most of you will remember Brian who used to work here. We went out on a bushwalk and we spotted this massive herd of zebra on Quarantine, which is a big open area just close to the DRC. And it's not very often that you get to get so close to these animals on foot. I heard an, an update on the radio and one guide said that he'd seen an injured zebra up on the open plains and near the DRC. So I was not too far away. I made my way straight there to see if I could follow up, obviously hoping that it wasn't one of the McCurdy Herdy members. And as we arrived at the scene, we then discovered that it was a young mare. She had some really, really horrible injuries to her body. I really feel a little bit sorry for the zebra, especially because it's all on its own and, and you can desperately see it's wandering around aimlessly. It's trying to find the rest of the herd. My suspicion would be that one lioness uh, tried to grab her and unfortunately got on the wrong side of the hooves of that zebra and ended up falling off of the zebra and the zebra made an escape. It's obviously quite a difficult thing to see and we tried our absolute best to follow her through her recovery, what, what we were hoping would be a recovery and we saw her three more times uh, after the incident. I don't think we have any idea what the chances are. That's a severe injury but it's not internal. Everybody is worried about the zebra, of course, uh, especially because it is part of the McCurdy Herdy. However, remember animals are resilient and even though she has disappeared, it doesn't mean that she has passed on. Who knows, in a couple of months time, she may come rejoining the rest of the McCurdy Herdy and we see the zebra with the most unusual markings and that one day we'll see her back in action, fully uh, recovered and healthy and who knows, maybe bearing a foal by her side.